Meantime, Justin Campbell there, uh, he's been in San Jose all afternoon and uh, tonight talking with people in the neighborhood. And Justin, the longer this horrific mystery goes unsolved, you can only imagine that people in that neighborhood are going to bed anxious and scared tonight. That's right. We spoke to a family member earlier, and then we also spoke to some neighbors that are basically saying they don't want to let their kids outside and play. They're concerned that this happened in seconds. Here's what I want you to do. I want you to see exactly where this kidnapping happened at. I'll step out aside, and you can see that building, that white building in the corner with the lights on. We're told that it was a second floor where this happened. Now, I want to go to some video that police have released so you can see what they're asking uh, from you at home that if you may recognize this suspect, please give them a call. They're saying that the suspect is a Hispanic male, uh, black pants with a dark blue shirt, gray shoes with white trim, short hair, gray baseball hat, and a black face mask. Now, this suspect may have already changed clothes, but if you know anybody that uh, maybe any tips, any leads that can lead them to this, give make sure you give police a call. Now, one of the neighbors that I spoke to earlier, very concerned. I want you to hear what she has to say. I'm, I feel sad about the mother, and I'm scared. Because I had two kids. I need to pay attention more on my kids. Because they like to play outside and run outside. Now, a, a lot of the neighbors that are out here right now are asking us questions. If we have any information, and we're giving them the latest. Police said they will be here all night. As you know, the FBI is assisting. And as we learn more about what happened, we'll sort of pass that along to you on air and online. But that's really the latest that we have from right here. Reporting here in San Jose, Justin Campbell, Cron 4 News.